Hello Gemini, this is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss with your November 2018 Mini Tarot Reading. Let's take a shuffle here and see what's coming up for you. Please remember this is a general reading and if you'd like one just about you, please stop by my website. It is listed below at www.soulstarbliss.com. Get yourself an appointment and we'll get to it as quickly as we can. Okay, let's see what's coming up for you here in November. Oh my goodness. Okay, it says that if you have a vacation journey planned or you don't have, maybe your partner and you knew, do, <laughs> maybe your partner and you need to get away for a little bit. It says pay attention to the feelings of others around you. Maybe it's your spouse, maybe it's your sister, maybe it's your brother, maybe it's your child. I don't know, but it just says that, yes, you're a very hard worker and it looks like you're, um, the people that are closest to you, some of you are assuming they know everything. Heads up, they don't. If you want to tell them you love them, that would be great. If you, I appreciate you. Thank you. Just be a little verbal in that area here. It says in the past, change was made and it brought great things for you. It made you realize. And I feel this is in the work area because a lot of you are just outstanding. Outstanding in the work area and need a little help with the uh, relationship department maybe. But it says Spirit's helping you. If you've asked for help, it's right there for you. There's going to be reasons to celebrate for you. Uh, maybe you're uh, doing what you love to do. Maybe you've made a big commitment for work and things have changed. Maybe you met somebody. It just says that there's going to be, there's promise of celebration all around you for this month for different reasons. It says choices you've made are, are um, official choices and a Gemini usually does what they say and says what they do. Although they do speak a lot sometimes, sometimes they say nothing and that sends a big message too. So again, back to the relationship. Make sure you speak up and tell people how much you appreciate them. Or if something's bugging you about them, speak up before it becomes into a big tornado. It just says talk in the personal level is needed for some of you this month. And it says you'll get used to it. You don't like to talk about stuff like that. Well, too bad. You, it just says some of you really need to. Maybe the, your partner needs to hear it. It says you are going to have gaiety in the midst of change. Things are going up and down. Maybe work has been really busy and maybe it's going to get a little slower. That's okay because it looks like some of you really do need to take some rest and time for yourself. Um, it says things have gotten much better in the area of finances for some of you. But maybe you're working too much. Maybe you're working too hard. Not that your family doesn't appreciate it for those of you that are, you know, in a relationship or in a family. But it says don't give your power away to home or to work. You have to find happy balance. Easier said than done, I know. But it says you've been noticed. And, and this is really about work. If you... Um, are new on a job or you maybe work, you got a new supervisor or whatever, people are noticing that you are someone that can be dependable and someone that can be depended on. And so some of you have been having a walk of feeling alone. Maybe you are working too much and don't know what to do about it. And you just have to learn that word, no, <laughs> I can't today or something like that. But it says you've um, set yourself up to be very successful in the work area, many of you, and you're making the right choices, but don't forget to take choices about you. Don't forget to, you know, get some rest. You really can say no. It seems like you're a jack of all traits in ways and everybody wants your help. It says make the new, make this a start now for the new year, even if you have, need that long to make new beginnings uh, in the relationship department, whether it be family or love or, uh, you know, a partner, whatever. It just says, make sure part of that is about you. Ask yourself, you know, do I, you know, how is this serving me? Um, that's important. I don't know why. It says all your wants and wishes are right before you. You are uh, doing a lot of them. But again, I just feel like this, you're just like a, almost like a tornado of energy and you're forgetting to take care of yourself. You're forgetting to rest. You're for, if you're, you know, forgetting to do something, maybe you need to just take a coffee break, have a gelato or whatever it might be. It just says, make sure that you don't get so uh, hooked into helping everybody that you forget to take care of yourself. And it says, it doesn't matter what's gone. It matters what's left work is really appreciating I feel this is so heavy about work and home it's like too black and white make sure that when you are at home that you're at home and work is at work if you can at least occasionally it would be so good for you and if you're needing to take a journey with that fam with with that family with your family by all means get ready to set it up and then follow through with it don't you know talk about yeah we're going to do this and we're going to do that and then don't do it because it makes for a very sad partner on the other end and it says you're going to be guided it says that you are certainly someone who achieves greatness 
Don't forget who you are, Gemini, but be true to yourself. You help everybody on the planet. Let some people help you. Learn to say no or yes in the right way. This is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss. Gemini, I'm Gemini. Gemini, I'm so happy you dropped by to see me today. Happy Thanksgiving to you and your family if you're in the States. And many blessings to all of you that are watching. This is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss, and I'll see you again next month, Gemini.